guys and welcome back in a new video i hope you're doing great i'm doing fine in today's video i have an interesting video for you and for me as always and it's going to be eight tom ford killers cheap clones and if you watched my recent videos you know that i did the five like the top five uh, tom ford clones and this video is going to be eight also if you watched my top five i did put some fragrances like in some places that maybe they didn't deserve or something some of them did grow on me so this is like an updated list like uh, my really recent list also i added some fragrances so i will let you know everything about these Tom Ford clones to be honest guys like the Alhambra, the fragrance world, La Tafa they been killing it with these Tom Ford clones really really good quality performance and everything enough talk guys let's start with the fragrance that I put at the spot 8 and it's going to be this fragrance right here Alhambra lovely cherry and this is um, supposed to clone the Tom Ford the lost cherry it's a cherry cherry bomb I put it in the top 8 maybe it deserves more like I just put it in this place because it's way too feminine to my taste like it's really sweet the quality is superb it is really soft and smooth if you like those fragrances that don't have alcohol like at the opening don't give headaches don't have that strong arab smell this one is for you nothing arab about this fragrance no oud nothing only western quality really high quality L last long but not a beast mode last eight seven hours really good for this fragrance it smells like a cherry like a coca-cola cherry it's really nice one of the main notes that you are going to smell is cherry of course vanilla banana and some coca-cola vibe in some amber to give it like a artificial fragrance note uh, so it doesn't smell really like a, like a soda or something they put some amber some like some artificial notes to make it smell like a perfume so this one is really nice the opening is really fruity and like uh, boozy but boozy like a soda not like a liquor so it's really nice and at the spot 7 I put this one right here the Tom Ford um, Neroli Portofino clone I don't know if I spelled that right or wrong but anyway this one is called Alhambra Porto Neroli it is actually good for someone who loves Neroli but it's really not for me although guys I can say that this one did grow on me a lot like because when I tried it I did the first impression of it I really didn't like it I was like so disappointed but now it did actually change let me tell you something let me spray it first it is so good actually yeah it is really nice to be honest right now because I didn't like at first when I tried it like you can go and watch the first impressions of this I didn't like it it did have a really strong neroli note with no citruses nothing fruity at all but now when I let it settle and like the uh, ingredients mixed together well after spraying it for the first time the oxygen enters the bottle and mix the other chemicals and ingredients now I can smell the neroli it's still strong but I can smell some fruits some mandarin some some florals also with with one note that I'm not sure they mentioned it guys it does have a sticky nougat vibe I promise you guys like it is so obvious like like a nougat or a sticky candyish vibe like you know that sticky candy like that candy it's not bubblegum it's like really sticky does have a little bit of like a honeyish type not honey smell but like that stickiness of that candy I don't know what you call it in your country but anyway this is not straight up neroli and citruses it has a candy smell that you can pick easily like after letting it I don't know if I am the only one who gets that but anyway I do get that uh, I'm just being like honest this has like another note neroli citruses little bit of florals and the candyish vibe really nice it doesn't last very long four to five hours on my skin when I tried it still a really nice scent if you love neroli not really like not youthful though it's more for someone who is mature it's an old school type of scent 
and at this spot 6 guys I put this fragrance right here the Toscano leather if you watch my video you will know that I put this really really high like uh, maybe 3 or something in the recent video now I just changed my mind on this one and on uh, another fragrances but anyway this is a nice release not for me it is really fruity and leathery masculine really lovely scent but it's not really youthful it's for someone who is in his 30s I always say that it is a clone of the Tuscan leather really nice really perfect clone quality is superb just like in all of these right here maybe some of them have better quality than others I will let you know this one has a superb quality just like the other ones I talked before and at the spot 5 guys I put Woody Oud which I don't have in my list right now but I tried it my friend has it I tried it and it's a really nice scent to be honest it smells better than the other ones that I mentioned it has like uh, I don't know something gourmand a little bit and woody as the name says the oud is really soft and not as aggressive or animalic which is really why I put it in this place just because it's um, they did oud in a really nice modern western way not it wasn't like strong or aggressive or give you headache type of scent plus the price is superb all of these are under $30 which is amazing like these deserve right here 50 60 like you can pay 80 100 for anyone right here and maybe you will not regret it they smell good and they perform quality is nice so guys Woody Wood is the clone of the Tom Ford Woodwood and they did it really good guys so I don't have it but I really did try it and it was a really nice try nice scent so you can grab that one if you like something woody and cheap with really high quality and like a luxury scent for the lowest price and at the spot for I put this fragrance right here this one bright peach it did really grew on me as you know if you watched my recent video of the Tom Ford clones I put this really like a 4 or something but right now I put it still 4 but in like a, I do prefer it now over the Tuscan leather and some others but before I didn't so that's crazy guys this one did really grew on me this is a clone of wow so fruity superb quality like I'm amazed guys how they do it I'm sure it's not me because every time like I'm scrolling through my Facebook and the post of the fragrance groups someone posts one of these and say that he's shocked so I know that is not me like these are getting discontinued guys go and grab them so this is the clone of the uh, bitter peach Tom Ford and it smells like a peach like like a peach soda or a peach juice really realistic note also really long lasting I put it in the top one best spring Latafa fragrance it deserve it that fruitiness of the peach and sour from the citruses it does have a really beautiful vibe beautiful scent really long lasting to perform they get me some compliments not too much but it does get you notice this. this DNA right here is really good and at the spot tree I put this one right here Fabulo Intense this is so good this is like if you want to smell rich and luxurious for the lowest price also it smells like a baby wipes I know some of people tell me that it smells like baby wipes some of them disagree I'm from the people who agree this has a like a powdery baby wipes it smells like almond lavender like a vanilla note but not a sweet vanilla it's a bitter almond and vanilla combo also tobacco and leather in the background to give it a masculine touch performs so good too last 8 to 10 hours really good fragrance guys I think you should give this one a try the clone of the Tom Ford F fabulous really really good I talked about it too many times in this channel but it deserve it and at the second spot I put the fragrance uh, Meso fragrance world tobacco on vanilla which I also don't have but I did have it in the past I just let my friends get that one so he can try it I don't have it with me right now but if you watched my like the recent Tom Ford list you knew that I put it in the top one the Tom Ford um, tobacco vanilla clone that fragrance guys is really really good like the fragrance world tobacco and vanilla it has a licorice candy vibes with tobacco and spices 
all that what it smells like it's gourmand licorice black licorice candy vibe and it was really gourmand sweet and nice but also with a little bit of spices and woods it was so nice and gourmand that one has a really perfect quality maybe the best quality in this list it is and the first uh, first fragrance that i'm going to show you now like maybe they have the best quality like they are amazing to be honest that one like the tom ford tobacco vanille clone you should pick it up guys i don't know if it's getting discontinued just like the other ones because they are from different companies but anyway you should try that fragrance really really good guys and at the first spot the fragrance that it did took the tobacco vanille clone spot is this one right here so popular these days fragrance world ebony fume so so good the coloring the presentation to everything it has like a transparent bottle with the gold writing and stuff it is so good it is the clone of the tom ford ebony fume this one is ebony fume really similar name really similar scent even though i didn't try the ebony fume but i don't think it's going to be really different this one is if somebody put it in a decant and sprayed it and he told me this was like a tom ford fragrance i wouldn't really like think he was lying or something because it is really good and what this one smells like this one has a sticky vibe like uh like a olibanum no like the olibanum in this fragrance is only in the background but what you smell is burnt woods in some sweet note and the olibanum gives it like this sticky bubblegum feel gourmand really really nice let me give you a quick spray yeah guys exact so good i don't know how they do it like it is really really good for the price 25 dollars which i picked this one that's really superb as i told you it is woody in the front if you want what i like about tom ford and tom ford clones is that they only put few notes like they don't mix a lot of notes together they put only few notes like and you know what you're smelling and what i'm smelling here is the amber in the front that uh, woody note and also a burnt woods with the olibanum sweet sticky vibe at the background if you want to smell smoky so so good fragrance right here i'm so happy that i picked this one it was somebody from the channel michael a subscriber he always told me to get this one and i really did and i didn't regret it so so good last long also eight to ten hours really perfect scent really nice i don't know really luxurious and high quality so guys this was the video i hope you liked it i really did like making this video just like i like making all of the videos for you thank you so much like the video subscribe to see more and see you in the next video